respected students welcome back everyone so today's video is about how to get a power bi job in 2025 okay so there are seven points which i have made each and every point i am going to explain properly see this video i am making from my personal experience what switches i have done from one company to another secondly uh, i also take interview in my companies also so more than 100 of candidates interviews i have taken so from that personal experience also how selection process is there and how the process is there everything i am going to explain you okay so whether you are a fresher whether you are experience of 2 years 5 years doesn't matter this video is applicable to everyone so i am going to cover fresher plus experience also okay so total seven points i have came with so we will uh, start with all the points properly but um, if you are new on our channel make sure you are subscribing and pressing bell icon for all upcoming videos i am making video on power bi and data analytics completely real time everything and follow us on social media especially instagram so let's start with the first point so if you want to get a job as a power bi developer in 2025 see first of all let's understand the market so whether vacancies are there yes vacancies are there there are many vacancies even on nokri if you will go you will see more than 70000 80000 one lakh jobs for power bi sql keyword for bangalore location pune location hyderabad chennai gurgaon top 10 whatever metro it cities are there everywhere you will get the uh, openings ha huh? especially 80 90% openings are there for experience more than 2 plus years but for freshers also openings are there but less sir openings are there okay so first of all openings are there so point number 1 first point see uh, your nokri profile must be very good let me tell you there are three things nokri resume and linkedin okay chronological wise also i am telling the first is nokri which must be 100% complete the most important point on nokri is that your profile must be ranking on power bi keywords okay power bi sql um uh, or uh, excel or data warehousing business intelligence data analytics like this main keyword are there but the main two keywords are power bi and sql your profile must be ranking on that check in the search appearance okay first second thing is that you your profile must get at least i would say 100 200 views daily except uh, saturday sunday your profile must get 100 200 views daily see let me tell you from my personal experience i personally think that i am the most uh, luckiest person of nokri profile because see uh, i have even seen the thing like more than 5 to 6 daily seven calls i have received ha huh? my profile was ranking on nokri power bi keywords and i was getting more than 400 500 views daily properly i used to update everything whatever the nokri algorithm was that that i have cracked along with keywords and it skills and career consulting everything so your nokri profile must be ranking on power bi keyword and daily you should get good views second thing your resume see for resume specific i have made video you can go and watch that video also but let me tell you for a experienced person how the profile must be project must be there compulsory your work experience properly your summary should be there of whatever uh your work you have done professional synopsis must be there in that project also detail explanation should be there uh, there again certification you should add personal information declaration everything linkedin profile must be there if you are having portfolio then you should add that also so resume is also main thing because when when hr finds the op, uh, candidates if there is opening then he first goes on nokri profile and from that nokri profile he first checks nokri profile and then he downloads resume and if your resume is good then he sends to the uh, panelist or whatever it is the personally i will tell you my uh, our senior that hr sends us resume yeah these are some of the resumes and we are going to schedule so resume also main nokri also main and the last one is linkedin linkedin must be little bit professional profile you must have but this is the first point and let me highlight the main thing is that your nokri profile if you are finding job as a power bi developer your nokri profile must be ranking on power bi keyword along with 100 200 searches daily second is uh, see if you are finding job as a experience see fresher you are there then um, i would say intermediate level knowledge of power uh, power bi knowledge is enough 
लाइक पावर बी आई सर्विस आई वुड से लिटिल बिट ऑप्शनल पावर क्वेरी एंड पावर बी डेस्कटॉप इज ओके विजुअलाइजेशन मॉडलिंग एंड डैक्सेस बेसिक इंटरमीडिएट ओके एस क्यूल ऑल्सो मोर देन बेसिक इफ इट्स देर देन ऑल्सो इट्स फाइन फॉर अ फ्रेशर फॉर अ एक्सपीरियंस टू थ्री फोर फाइव इयर्स एस्पेशली फॉर थ्री प्लस यू मस्ट हैव मोर देन इंटरमीडिएट लेवल नॉलेज ऑफ पावर बी आई ओके सो वेदर इट इज पावर क्वेरी पावर बी डेस्कटॉप और पावर बी सर्विस यू मस्ट हैव नॉलेज बिकॉज यू आर Showing, see, I know that there are many people who converts the experience, who shows the experience. There are many, there are few candidates who has the real experience also. But if you will see the real candidates, they had work on that tool for three years, so definitely they will know Power BI service also. So definitely they will know Power Query. Definitely they will know Power BI desktop along with DAX and modeling everything. So understand, na, if you are using any tool for three years, then definitely end to end, so you had worked on that tool. So you must have that. proper knowledge i would say if you are having experience ha huh, power bi service still i would rate little bit uh, down only but power query dax modeling power bi desktop or whatever the things are there that you must have i am not saying you should have you must have the knowledge if you are showing or having 3 years of experience into power bi along with that our database tool which is there whether it is sql snowflake azure there also you sh you should be able to write the queries and you should be able to face the data okay then validate that data okay so as a power bi developer you must know and see let me tell you one thing there are four teams okay ba data engineer bi team and qa team so we are the part of bi team perfect okay so see apart from that for data engineer sql developer and all those things are there but for ba and qa see in many companies i would say i have seen i work with many clients BA and QA are not compulsory. So, as a Power BI developer, if you will learn that thing also, basics of business analyst, requirement gathering, how to have client interaction, documentation, everything, and QA work. What is there in QA work? UI validation, data validation, and performance testing of the report. Like how much time it's taking for loading in data validation, whether the numbers are matching from SQL to Power BI. For UI validation, you should check whether bookmark is working or all those things. so apart from bi if you will learn these things also basics ba and qa so while giving interview let me tell you one thing i am also taking interview if i see any candidate apart from bi if he is knowing business analyst and qa work also basic then for me that candidate is always special okay so this is also the selection criteria let me tell you one thing so basics you can learn okay and apart from that see if you are knowing only sql na See, Snowflake and SQL is ninety percent same on liquidities and all those things. And if you will see two three hours tutorial of Azure Data Bricks, that will also help you in your profile, in your resume. You can add that word. Ha, I have worked on that basics. I know. So it will actually make your profile strong. Okay. So the first point was of no crilling team. Second point was of advanced level or more than intermediate level knowledge of Power BI, especially for um, experienced candidate. Coming to third point. a uh, third point is of soft skill soft skills like uh, confidence and communication see long back when i have made video that time also i have told you that how much important confidence and communication is there see whenever i take interview that time what i follow is that somewhere 70% i check the technical knowledge power bi sql excel whatever data warehousing and 20 30% i check how proper his confidence and communication is there because for a power bi developer who is having 2 3 years of experience definitely is going to speak with the client perfect he is going to demo the report yes somewhere basics of requirement gathering he is going to take in sprint review he is going to demo and tell what he have done in this sprint okay so he must have good communication i would not say that best but at least survival english he should know okay whatever i am speaking right now that also is fine or little bit less than that that is also fine coming to confidence see why confidence is important na see whenever how you are challenging when real time works uh, is coming or how you are handling the things whenever the things are uh, not sorted properly so there your attitude confidence matters so we see that thing also in candidate so somewhere your confidence communication should be good how to make your communication good that speak with your family friends uh, speak with them in english okay Uh, or you can on your front camera and take one of the topic and speak on that topic and record that video and see afterwards how is your confidence communication 
at least in front of camera if it is good there then only you will face panelist or real time work properly na if it's not good then keep practicing okay keep practicing uh, face your mirror is there mobile camera is there go in front of your best friends whatever speak with them these things you can do but soft skills should be good because you are working as a front end developer bi developer is a front end not like support or anything uh coming to fourth point this uh, point is especially for those candidates who uh, convert the experience okay or uh, show experience like this see i have seen many times that they really have good knowledge of power bi okay or sql but they don't know how real time work is going on what is agile what is dev prod environment how project is worked how project is completed how project is developed how teams are there daily work that nothing uh, they don't know but see what see i have made all the videos like uh, dev versus prod environment agile methodology video jira video uh, project life cycle management project explanation one separate playlist is there you can go on our channel and check there also okay so there also it will help you but real time how work is going on even project end to end i have made in that also i have told how real time projects are there so you can watch those playlist i can't cover this point here because it's very big but real time work you should understand project life cycle management sprint 3 week sprint is there so that you can check that you will understand it will take max 2 3 hours for you but properly end to end everything you will understand okay so just additional one thing that see i have uh, i get many messages on instagram linkedin everywhere that uh, uh, you all guys uh, want to connect with me so i have launched my top mate page also one to one call directly you can have of career guidance power bi mock interview or you can say like um, other uh, also interview preparation and all those things uh, four services i am providing so you can book one on one call with me uh, in description the link is there for top mate okay coming to fifth point this is especially for freshers so you can build a good portfolio so you can create a power bi projects so whether it is of finance domain insurance domain health domain whatever domain it is but i would suggest uh, go with top 5 domains only of finance insurance health sector pharma logistics e-commerce and uh, make the reports and insert into that novi pro github two three this main websites are there there you can create your good portfolio especially of freshers i am telling and send to the hrs or managers of company or if anyone is referring you there you can say so portfolio will really help Uh, for freshers candidate for experience it doesn't matter because they had already worked on real time project so that doesn't matter but for freshers please try to build good portfolio and at least i would say minimum 3 3 projects maximum 5 projects you should have there properly and that projects you should be able to explain at least for minimum 120 seconds that is 2 minutes okay sixth point is of certifications see uh, certifications uh, pl 300 is good to have but not compulsory again i am repeating if you are having any financial issues then please you you can avoid it the reason is because uh, it takes around 5 to 7000 rupees and uh, if you are having any issues of financial then you can avoid it it's not compulsory like sales force job it is good to have okay this is the point and i have made one playlist of pl 300 where 100% ask questions are there around 40 15 50, 50 questions i have added you can go and watch that video also but certification is good to have for experience candidate candidate and it will help at least in client interview it will help that uh, foreign clients if they have two candidates one with pl 300 one with non pl 300 then definitely they will prefer the one with microsoft certifications in india it doesn't matter but in foreign it will matter but i am telling after client interview while getting project in company but for getting job it's not compulsory in 10 company one company will tell that we want but not all companies okay again i am telling if you are unemployed if your financial condition is not good in everything frankly i am telling please don't opt it it is not compulsory again i am repeat seventh point it's for freshers last point see referral is the biggest weapon for your job uh, you also know that freshers that from nokri linkedin you are not getting that many calls especially from nokri so i have told this i have told this thing many times that uh, referral is the main important thing so you should uh, ask for referrals that's the 
main important i would say way to get a job for a fresher so the one who are freshers and uh, they want to uh, job in 2025 as a power bi developer try to get more and more referrals in your relatives family friends whatever things are there you are send your resume to more than 100 people i would say and at least get 20 25 referrals definitely you will get a job okay so these were the seven points uh, which we have covered in this video okay so how to get a job as a power bi developer in 2025 the main point was your nokri profile should rank on power bi keyword and you should get more than 100 200 views so you will get like daily one or two calls definitely along with that after power bi end to end proper knowledge if you are experienced that is also quite important okay this was second point third i would say uh, for uh, the guys who convert and all those things experience and all those things real time try to get real time knowledge properly understand how the work is happening definitely you will get job okay so this was all about this video seven points i have covered properly and if you are having any doubt uh, make sure you are commenting within one hour i will reply if you want to book any session with me one on one on topmet you can book in description box the link is there and thanks everyone for watching till end so please subscribe and press bell icon for all new videos and follow us on social media thank you everyone